Matt from the JSA. We have three different neck exercises that we're going to go over today. This is good for anybody in any combat sport. So it's good for your wrestlers bridging off your neck. It's good for your boxers getting punched in the face. It's good for your Muay Thai guys in the clinch going uh, all around. So three basic ones we're going to cover yeses, noes, and ear to shoulders. For both of these, um, the key things to make this exercise work is it has to be done slowly and you need a full range of motion. Without both of these things, uh, you're pretty much wasting your time. So go slow, get a full range of motion out of it. This is going to be our yeses. We're going to be using gravity as our resistance for all of these. Um, we can progress up to manual resistance, but it's better to start lighter and go up. I would recommend starting with a set of uh, slow 20 to 30 uh, before continuing on. So I'm going to start with my head all the way back. I'm going to slowly tilt my chin forward. Till me contact with my upper chest. And then slowly back. These are our yeses like we're nodding in a yes motion. Remember, we don't want to go fast because this isn't really doing anything. We also want to go through a full range of motion. This isn't doing anything. We want to go all the way back and all the way forward. Those are yeses. Ugh. Our second exercise is called nose. We've got our head in a neutral position, which means we're not tilting it forward up and we're not letting it hang idly down. So it's staying right here. We're gonna turn our head all the way to the left, as far as we can over our left shoulder. Slowly returning to its starting position, turning our head to the right. Again, slow and a full range of motion. If I can, I don't want to stop here, if I can turn to here. Our last exercise is called ear to shoulders. Um, our starting position is the same as our second one, our nose. And we're going to bring our head with our left ear to our left shoulder. And then back to the starting position and our right ear to our right shoulder. Again to the left. And again to the right. I learned all three of these exercises from Coach Matt Bayless on the UConn football team. All of these have a, uh, obviously a neck strengthening benefit, which will help anybody that sustains hits to the head. So your football, your contact, your combat athletes, your football players, your wrestlers, your boxers, your strikers, your grapplers, uh, those are the ones that need the most uh, preventative concussion. Uh, female girls soccer will also benefit from, from this and any other sport which there's a lot of head contact injuries.